the Champion Phillies Stakes is next up then. Uh, this is a mile and a half for the Phillies and Mares, three year olds and upwards. Uh, let's take a look at the full list of this Group 1 field. The top one is Belladonna for Joshua Sutherland, Bon Maman for Ryan Tamasebi, Dazaki Loma, Craig Allen, Land of Marvels, Leon Van Rensburg, Nogales, Darren Thompson, Queen of the Night, or Leon Van Rensburg on a four timer South Africa, Ryan Tamasebi, Denver Baraka, Vinnie Ger Gerard, Duchess of Epsom. Paul Rhodes, Meghan Markle, Dan Hughes, Monumental, Paul Rhodes, and The Mandalorian for Craig Allen. So, 12 of them to go then. And this, all quietly installed, ready to go. And away they go then. And Queen of Night was quickly out, so too was Belladonna. She likes to lead the uh, last couple of races these next few weeks. I'm sure she won't be back for next season. Already a two season. Horse who was brilliant last year, sadly not quite lived up to those heights this year, but did I think get a good win earlier in the season. But anyway, Bella Donna's in the lead from South Africa in second, and Land of Marvels has moved through into third. Then a little bit wider on the track, Dazaki Loma, Denver Baraka is in between them. A little bit of a gap then to Bon Mamawa, Monumental. Megan Markle is in the bright blue jacket, trying to make a bit of a move in the centre of the pack. With the Mandalorian wide on the track. The Mandalorian looked like a world beater first time out and not really done a lot since. So that one we're looking to bounce back, but it's Belladonna, who's about five or six lengths clear of Land of Marvels in second, South Africa back in third, and then Denver Baraka is fourth. Then comes Dazaki Loma and Monumental, with Meghan Markle just moving up in between the two of those, wide on the track, Mandalorian. Then the red hot favourite Queen of Night being tracked by Bon Mamam. Uh, no gal is already being given the hurry up and Duchess of Epsom who wants to try and become the Duchess of Ascot is the back marker and currently struggling to go the pace but it's Belladonna that's setting that pace and bowling along in the lead by about three to four lengths to Land of Marvels in second South Africa now being pushed up into much closer order second the Mandalorian beginning to sweep round the outside of the track as well then uh, Meghan Markle's also trying to cover the run of Queen of Night Nogales is also getting a little bit closer but they're still going to get to Belladonna and she's still in the lead with four furlongs left to race so Belladonna then but only by two now to South Africa Land of Marvels is third then Queen of Night Mandalorian Meghan Markle and Nogales all starting to make their move and this Duchess of Epsom is also trying to get into it Dazaki Loma switched to the rail and is trying to run on as well then after that Bomber Mam Monumental is after that the one that looks beaten is Denver Baraka but it's Belladonna who's still three clear as they're coming down towards the final two furlongs Belladonna here comes Meghan Markle now throw down a big challenge of three on the outside then Queen of Night and Dazaki Loma and Duchess of Epsom is trying to get into it as well but Belladonna's take gonna take some passage yours does they hit the furlong pole and it's Belladonna in the lead Meghan Markle up the centre of the track Queen of Night is now starting to get going then Dazaki Loma Duchess of Epsom on the outside Meghan Markle's in the lead now Meghan Markle is racing up towards the line and he's going to cause a bit of an upset I think Meghan Markle takes it from Queen of Night Dazaki Loma Belladonna stuck on well for a brave fourth all the way back to Denver Baraka and Meghan Markle who I think won the Oaks earlier in the season has come back at the back end of the season and has taken that one and turned over the favourite uh, Meghan Markle the winner for Dan Hughes Queen of Night for Leon Van Rensburg was second Dazaki Loma for Craig Allen third Belladonna for Joshua Sullivan fourth Duchess of Epsom for Paul Rhodes was fifth <laughs>